Hi everyone, it's Dr. Laura Mock, the Life Coach for Busy Dentists again here today. I'm here to talk to you today about discomfort. Isn't it funny how I'm always focusing on some of those negative things on my videos, but just stick with me for a minute because this is really important. You know, there's a thing in our lives and the thing is that we're always trying to avoid feeling bad. And when I say bad, I mean like tired or, you know, getting sore muscles from working out or um, jealous. There's this um, aversion to these bad feelings. And I want to propose to you today that discomfort is the price of achieving your dreams. And just think about it for a minute. I know it sounds kind of weird, but if you think about it, what have you ever accomplished staying safe and comfortable? You're on the couch, you got your popcorn, you got your Netflix, you're comfy. But what is happening in your life? I remember when I decided to go to dental school and I had two small children and um, I would get up early on Saturdays to go to chemistry. I would go all day long and then I would go home and I would be a mom again Saturday night and Sunday and then Monday would come and I would mother all day long and then I would go to math class starting at 6 p.m. And then after my kids went to bed, I was tired. I wanted to... Um, go to bed myself. I'm an early to bed, late to rise kind of girl. And if you know me, you will attest to that. But I would stay up. I would drink my Dr. Pepper because I didn't know yet. That was hurting me in multiple ways. And I would do that math. And sometimes it was so uncomfortable because I hadn't really enjoyed math in high school, but I needed to master algebra in order to be able to apply to dental school. And I would do my chemistry homework too. It was the discomfort that helped me reach my dream. And I bet you guys can think of some examples of how that has worked in your life as well. More recently, I would say that um, as I have coached myself and learned about how my brain works and what's happening in my thoughts, and I have had to do that deep dive into what's going on in my brain, which is not comfortable and sometimes can be maybe humiliating or um, tiring, overwhelming. But I have to tell you, things are changing in my life, in my practice, with my children, in my marriage. This discomfort is helping me achieve what I want to live in a fully um, actualized life. So anyway, I was just wanting to point that out to you guys. I know this is another really short one, but I would love to hear from you and hear what discomfort you have gone through for the dreams you're trying to achieve or that you have achieved. I have, hope everyone has a great day. Thank you.